The Twin Tiers continuing to bake in extreme heat tonight. Good evening, I'm Jackie Gillis. And I'm Trina Catterson. Thanks for joining us tonight at 11. Hot temperatures are continuing to sit over our region. And now doctors at Arnett Health are reminding you that if you have to go outside, make sure to watch for heat-related illnesses in yourself and your children. The biggest thing with the heat, especially with this weather outside and the humidity that's making everybody just fatigued and very tired is ultimately hydration. If you're going to be outside on a day like today, staying hydrated is key. Drinking beverages with electrolytes like Gatorade, Pedialyte, or coconut water will better help prevent the fatigue that comes with the intense heat. So if you're outside prolonged walking, if you're going to do different events or the fairs, make sure you're sipping on water throughout the day. Attending fairs or festivals is a must for families in the summertime, but there are some things you should keep in mind so you can enjoy these outdoor festivities for a longer period of time. As far as food goes, you know, with all these festivals, there's always the cotton candies, the fried foods and such things, and they are what make the festival a lot more fun. And while you can have a lot of it, making sure how much you eat is important. Heat stroke can happen extremely quick, and while adults may be able to recognize when they're dehydrated, a child may not be able to communicate that they've been exposed to too much heat. What you want to keep an eye on for these little children is other signs of hydration. You can look at their mucous membranes, you can look at their mouth to see how well and how dry their mouth is if they are poorly hydrated, if they're exposed to excessive heat to enormous dryness in the mouth. And while staying hydrated and drinking lots of fluids is important, there are different types of clothing you can wear as well that are reflective of the sunlight. You see a lot of the marathon runners, a lot of these extreme sports, they will wear these types of clothing to maintain their hydration and to maintain the temperature of their skin and their body. And using these during these festivities are an easy way to improve your energy levels and to make sure that you stay well hydrated and energetic through these festivals.